M0FXB, welcome to my channel. We're going to have a go at programming a Retivis RT85. These are really cheap at the moment. You can buy them for about £30, especially in the USA. Uh, they're just VHF, UHF, you know, DTMF. It's nice, small, neat, quite loud, good audio, VHF, UHF, ham radio. So I thought I'd uh, program it using the software. I have programmed it using the radio. You can do that. So here's the software. Now the link for the software, just so you know, is here. It says support. I'll put the link in the description. And you can download the software. You don't really need firmware, really. The software, that's all you need. There's a brochure there. So let's have a look at it. Let's uh, have a look at the actual program. Now the cable I'm using, because mine didn't have the cable in the box, but they normally do. I'm using one of these all-in-one cables and they're about £12 on Amazon, eBay, that kind of thing. And they look like this. And they program all kinds of radios and it does work on this radio. So I'll put that link in just so you know what I'm using. So we'll look at the programming software. Once you've connected the cable, now of course I've done this already. So you go settings, comport, and then it's 13. How do we know it's 13? We right click device manager. Double click COM port and there it is there, USB serial CH340 is the one I've got. It's actually a prolific driver with the cable that comes with it, but this one works. So we know the COM number is 13, so we go settings, COM port select, so settings, then look, you can see here 13, enter. Then we can now read the radio, read like so, and if, if you've done it correctly, you're going to get this. It's quite basic software but like all software it can still be really confusing so we'll click OK uh, you can see the few I've got in there I can rename them now it's so hard to do on the radio when you name it's not hard to, to put the uh, a channel in and save it that's easy you just hold the put the channels in set the shifts hold the F and then you choose the channel and then save by put, finalizing it with the hash button that's how you do it when you're on the radio I'm just gonna put in some of these names so that one there is caps gb3 fi this one is let's have a look that's gb3 zb and i know i put i thought i put hubnet in there but anyway the next one down is that's fi again gb3 fi we can check the shifts 77 yeah the frequencies are in there so let's put in my my all-star node which is Four three four dot five 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 zero. Oh, it looks like it's putting it across. Now you can expand this window. Four three four dot five five zero. I'll show you. you can expand it, and then the tone is. We don't need decode. So leave that off. We only need it on transmit. So CTCSS of seventy seven on transmit to open it up. Uh, power. Oh, that's at home. So we'll leave that low. But with the repeaters. I want that high because I'll be outside. Um, what else we got here? Let's put in 145.600, that's GB3WR, which is 145.500. Oh, actually, we need that on off. We just do them for now, and then I'll do some more later. 94.8 and then high. Now I'll just show you what it looks like when you fully expand it. Oh, I did that frequency wrong. 145.000, that one should be on the input. So repeaters, you transmit on one frequency and receive on another. You've got tone encode 94.8. If you double click here, you get this bigger window and you can set more things. It looks like DTMF. Hmm. Begin, end, both. I haven't done DTMF at the moment. Scan. Okay, that seems fine. Let's have a look at the settings thing while we're here. Not bitrate, file, at the basic settings. Display mode, yeah, you can display channel or memory, and that's important if you want to use memory names. Squelch, intro, I can add here. M0FXB, it will just say that when it boots up. Andreas. Dual watch, you want that on because you want to hear both, but you only hear one at a time, but it will monitor both. Radio money, I'm not sure what that is. Dual watch, TX tone, which on that channel, uh, 
Uh, oh no, we don't want that. LED mode on, the light brightness, beep, key mode, ah, that tells you what the keys do, key and side key. Okay, enter, what else we got here, DTMF, uh, what's all this? Cool, got some DTMF in there, I'm gonna have to play with this, work out how to do it, it's so confusing. PTT begin, PTT end, stun code, kill code, what's all that? It's obviously doable. Um, frequency, click enter, radio, frequencies. I literally don't know what any of that is. Right, well, that's, it's got everything I need, so let's go program right to radio. That will now write to the radio. You can see the radio in the background. Hopefully, when I go through the channels, we will see. It says succeed. Turn it up, we'll go to memory mode by pushing the hash. Let's do it. Yeah, we'll go one, up and down with the arrows. Yeah, it's all in there. And that's, I think it's better, I don't even want memory names. If I wanted memory names, don't you go F. I think it's like 30, let's try 32. Back out a minute. I'm not pushing too many buttons. Oh, it's not letting me do it with the cable in. But that's okay. Let's go into Vox. Back out. F32. Okay, let's go. Display, frequency, or memory. So you go like so. Go up to memory. Exit. And if I go through the channel, it should have some names there. Go down. There you are, GB3 FI, ZB, FI. So it has worked. Bye for now, 73. Thanks for watching my channel. Links in description.